Hi guys, so for today's video I'm going to be doing a guinea pig or rabbit. So what you're going to need is, this is a guinea pig targeted toy, so if you're going to, if you have guinea pigs, then watch this one, if not, then just skip it or something. So this is going to be for guinea pigs, what you're going to need is one of these, hay, and, or some kind of a treat, it doesn't really matter what you stuff it with, but you always have hay when you have a guinea pig, so then, you know, use that. You're going to also need scissors, we'll just make sure there's no, um, like, glue on these. You know how there's sometimes glue on this, it's toxic, so make sure there's not on here. Now you're just going to make little holes throughout the, um, this thing, throughout the toilet paper holder, paper towel holder, whatever. You have. It's harder to do than it looks. Okay, actually, I'm not gonna put holes in this, but you can if you want, just because I don't want this video to be very long, and I just want, I just want to do this quicker. So I'm just going to do one of the other things you can do is just cut like little like these on it. I don't know, just do this. Okay, yeah, you get it. Just do that the whole way around on both sides, then stuff it with hay. On to the next toy. We're going to be making a. I'm sure you've seen this, but they're like, they're balls of, made out of these. You can make balls out of these to stuff them with treats. And then your animal will just, it'll, they'll love it because it's stuffed with treats. And it's, yeah, it's fun to roll around the cage. So you're going, what you're going to do is just cut little strips of these, whatever you have. I don't really know how many, it doesn't really matter, just as long as it's, I mean, I don't know, it doesn't matter really. If you need more, just cut more. So you're going to just cut them and then they'll be like this. With that, I cut four. I don't know if this will work. If this doesn't work out and then make a whole ball, then we'll just... Then we'll just cut more. But it should work out fine. See, now all you do is... Okay, I'll show you what you do. You just take one of these and you put one around it. Maybe like... Or like this. And then I guess all you really need is two, but I mean, I'm using more than two. Then you just put one around that. And there you go. And then I'm gonna put one more on, so make sure you have even amounts, like like an even number of these. Okay, so this is one of my favorite ones, but the only problem is that guinea pigs or hamsters, like it, it just falls apart. It doesn't really hold its shape very well. But the more you put, the more structurally sound it is. Just you want to stuff it with things, and then it might. It, it's hard to stuff it with things. Next one I'm going to be making is. It's great for hamsters because they can unfold it or something. They'll have fun with it. Just the last one was good for hamsters too, but you can't really give them. I mean, they don't eat hay, so I don't know what they would do with that. So we're just going to cut. I'm just going to make a smaller one. So I'm going to because I. <laughs> I don't know because it's faster. So, just going to cut one. Get one of your paper towel or toilet paper holders. Then you're going to just do the same thing we did with the first one, but longer and thinner. I guess. So then just do that all the way around on both sides. And once you're done with that, on both sides you can do this. Um, just fold them, after you stuff them, you're gonna fold them like this, just fold them down. And then it'll be closed, so it'll be like a little present thing that they can just like try to open. Guinea pigs will just, and rabbits will just chew it open and get the hay or whatever's in it. And just make sure you fold it good after you stuff it. Then it should look like this on both sides. So I ended up fixing the first one that I did. I ended, I added holes. I didn't do this on both sides, and I folded them outwards. 
and I stuffed them with romaine lettuce. Okay, so the first one's going in first. We're gonna see which ones I like best. And I know their cage is dirty. I'm gonna clean it right after I do this video. Okay, so just put it down, see if they like it. And then I'm gonna take it out after because I want them to go look at the other ones too. She looks like she's interested. Peach is probably not gonna come out. If she does come out for one of them, that's automatically the winner because she's very shy. So, okay, she likes it. And Peaches looks like she wants it, but she, she's getting ready to eat. She's moving her lips, sniffing around. And she's probably not gonna, oh my God, she's coming. This is a rare moment. They seem to like that one. No, let's add this one, which has hay in it. Okay, it's the ball one. They can't really roll, roll it around because of these hay things sticking out. But if you want to clip that with scissors, you can. Oh, she's she shot her teeth. See, that's the untamed one I was talking about in my last video. Okay, let's put that down. See, she's completely fine. She'll let me cut her too. Like, she just doesn't care. She's nice. Very tame, and then she. I don't even think she'll. Oh, she sniffed me. Okay, so let's add this one. I don't think they'll even like it. I mean, it's stuffed with spinach and romaine lettuce. Actually, that one has a spinach in it too. Put that down. I mean, she really just cares about the food. I mean, I don't really think that any of them. It doesn't really matter. You could pretty much just give them food plain. I mean, she keeps going back to that one. I think it's just because it's easiest to get food out of that one quick. So I think that that one is the winner. The first one's the winner for guinea pigs. So the guinea pigs liked the first one the best. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Give it a like, comment down below, and subscribe if you want to see the next video.